Hello and welcome everyone to this new tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn how to install Python on Windows 11. The solution I'm going to provide also works on Windows 10. So let's get started. Well, first we head over to the Python website. After that, we click on this downloads link right here. Then we click on this button right here so we can download the latest version. And the installation package starts to download. We can also do it another way. We can click download all releases. Head over here and we choose a release. We click on that release. Then we scroll down and we click on the Windows installer 64-bit as it is the common architecture nowadays in Windows system. So we click in on Windows installer 64-bit. Okay, now after our download has finished, we can check the downloads folder for the installer. Then we double click it. And here comes the most important part, the part where we are going to check stuff and to click on stuff and to see stuff and we agree on stuff. So this is the most important part. This is the most important window. First, we click on add to path. Okay. And we click on custom installation. We keep all of those checked, but the most important part, part is keeping the add Python to path that's so important after that we click on custom installation we keep all of those we click next we click here on install python for all users so so this is becomes the default path for python which is great we keep all the ones we already found we don't check any other one and we click install after that we agree we click yes and then we wait for the installation to finish. Check this, this is an important part. Maybe you are working with many uh, files, many directories, maybe your length is so long, so we can't keep this uh, enabled. We should disable the path length limit. I recommend this. After that, we click on close and we press Windows CMD we open the command prompt just to make sure that Python has been installed in a successful, correct way. We write Python. And as you can see, we have the Python uh, prompt and we can start writing Python code as you can see here. And it's working. Thank you for watching the video and see you in another one.